How are you, Katie? Fine. You did get your hair done. I did. It is lovely. He says, lying through his teeth. I am. It's not on my head. I know. I'm hardly one that can comment about hairstyles, really, ever, really? am I? No, exactly. Harry, uh, you really need this cup of tea. I That's wasn't really here yesterday. We have been busy today. Actually, it's been very busy today. It's been very busy to this. Um, I wasn't here yesterday. Um, I was out working for 11, which is a novel concept for me. Um, you could have done one on your own, but you chose not. No. Because everybody's saying, oh, they want to see Katie, lovely Katie, Maury Katie, Katie's lovely. But if the truth be known... That's only liquid, but that doesn't mean anything. Uh, maybe that's what it is. Uh, anyway, we're doing bottles. We're doing bottles. Uh, what did I touch on Middleton that isn't Middleton? Ish. Ish, you know, anything from the, the IDL family. Um, obviously, Middleton's getting all the publicity at the minute, but there is some other cracking bottles. Um, these ones, these are the 14 year old uh, American releases for uh, Redbreast. Um, some of the real tough ones to get there, the Title Town, there's amazing Corbo there as well, um, and the other ones, the Black and Blackwells and all that sort of stuff. They are going. Nothing. Carry on. Oh, carry on. Sorry, just something caught me eye. Is that both of them? Look at that. Just do your sentence. What are you talking about me, Mickey, hanging out? <laughs> Shouldn't be doing that. There's so we? much wants to come out from that. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, oh, I'd like to see. It's really <laughs> There, a lot of guys got the collection initially and chased ones and, and, and worked really hard to get them. They come up very now and uh, every now and then and they, they still get good prices. So And it's a lovely collection. I think yeah, yeah. the sacks are lovely. I've seen yeah, no, I know a couple of guys with the full collection of that. Yeah, really does yeah, lovely. Um, Redbreast Mano Love. So it was the first Dreamcast, essentially. essentially yeah. um, they're the ones that guys go over. I mean, Dreamcast won now. Last couple of auctions have got some great, great prices. Um, so if you have a red breast collection, you'd have to have a manual. Oh, you'd love. have to have a manual. Um, that'd be another good one. Yeah, I had it here. A lot of them open, wasn't it? Because people didn't realise at the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's that's true of a I lot of the the, the the stuff that comes out. You know that the people don't think. I mean, you know, they, they never think of a collection when one or two bottles are out. No. It's only now that people are going, oh, I've got to get them all. They're not oh, Pokemon. Um, there's a real humdinger that is a housewarming so that was done when Brian Nation took over as a master distiller from Barry um, they go great they really and it, even now I think more so the importance of it because it was the handover from Barry to Brian and now Brian's gone and now Brian's yeah. gone so it, it will be a, a, another good one um, a lot of guys looking for these ones the, the Method of Madness um, so that's a batch two. How you can tell batch two has got the, the black strip on the bottom. Um, the what? No. French chestnut. Oh, we have we we have the cherry one too. The, the cherry, cherry one, one there. I think there is a few there. There is some batch ones there as well. Uh, Paddy Centenary is is sort of went a wee bit wild and it's come back a wee uh, bit now yes. and guys are, are are still liking it. Apparently, but, it's a nice drinker. Yeah, a lot of guys love that for the drinking. Um, the green spot that is a Leoville Barton, it's our favorite. probably one of my favorite green spots, and I you get, do love it as well. I got very drunk on five drinks to midnight drinking that stuff. <laughs> oh, I it's made, him. I made a show with myself with, with the question with IDL in France, so just love the story. Uh, <laughs> uh, blue spot is the latest addition to it, and um, there was thoughts of it being uh, hard to get. Um, some guys are still finding it struggling yeah. to get in, in retail shops now, but it is a bit about everywhere. I so, think it's the whole shop around you can find it. Yeah. Yeah. You're not allowed to point out the obvious, Katie. I know, but that, I can't help it. You know. Um, that here was one I just picked off the shelf because I seen it. Um, this was the final selection at uh, Jemson Masters Distillers, uh, choice. So they're all the Jemson Twelve in different presentations done but in this box. Twelve in there. Is there a Bushman Yes, it's all master distillers. Um, look, turn around. I can't. It's heavy. It's so not bad, drop baby. It. Don't want to drop it. Oh, the Bush, Bushmans. I'm off to being when, obviously, when Bushmans was part of the ideal family. There you go. There's something behind your head. And when it came in, I said, I've got to talk about that. That. Oh, the sheep. 
It's made with sheep shite. It's not made with sheep shite. Who makes whiskey with sheep shite? They, they, they burn it to... Do th- I don't want any part of sheep shite in me whiskey. I'm, I'm sorry. I, you know. It's a very old Icelandic tradition. Yeah, they and smoke the barley. It's not actually... They smoked the, the barley. barley. They were smoking something else when they thought of them. Someone shot up with that. Somebody was off <laughs> their face. I reckon they stood close to the smelly shape too long. And Well, they don't have trees in Iceland. Well, they do, but they're very few and far between. So they can't be chopping down all the trees to smoke this stuff. Just gonna, I'm gonna use smoke the shit. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. so they were smoking the shit. Yeah, hey, we're smoking the shit. Lovely. Yeah, so, uh, what? I'd love to taste it. Just out of no, the pure no, novelty factor. Mm-mm. No? Mm-mm. Oh, come on. Wouldn't it be good crack? Well, yeah, lads tonight. And you know the way the lads go, you know, there's a fresh cut grass and elderberry flowers and rubber boot. Tastes like Why sheep shite. Tastes like, tastes like sheep shite. How do you know? <laughs> what sheep shite are you eating? <laughs> so anyhow. I can't cope. I'm so tired. I am. We are tired. We, we have been a tough day. Um, we will be back tomorrow. Possibly do scotch tomorrow. There's a fair few. Yeah, we there's a bit, lovely we've a fair bit of scotch. In yeah, there. fair oh, bit of scotch. In. There's a lovely 1964, 65 Abelur there. Um, I think it's an Abelur. I don't know. My brain's not working. Um, and I mean, you're tongue tied trying to say Abelur. something. Name. What? They're more, they're, they're just weird. I'd have to write Bonner it. Bonner You like the boat? The boat. Yeah, that's, that's, the, that's not the boat. boat. I'll have, the board. The board. I'll have to do a list of all weird Scotch names and try and pronounce them on a video. Or have you? No, no, I won't have you do it because you're a posh kid and you'll know all of the words. Not posh. Yeah, tell your mother that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, until tomorrow, farewell, friends. Bye. What are you wearing tomorrow? Are you wearing more Sandy stuff? I don't know. I have an old Sandy Guna and an old Elf Guna. I might chuck that on. Can I wear a Sandy Guna? If you can squeeze into it, have, that'd be some crack. I'll wear one and you wear one. A Sandy Guna? Yeah. I think I've got the legs for it. You do? And at the weekends I can dress up and call myself Jennifer. There you go. Bye! Bye!